Hey folks, Roger van Bakel here with Eager Eye Photography. Um, I wanted to talk to you today about this nifty little trick that enables you to use, uh, if you happen to have two iMacs sitting on your desk, you can use one of those iMacs as an external screen, a secondary screen to the other one, and all it takes is about a $10 investment. So you don't need anything else. All you need to do is buy this cable. Um, you don't need anything Thunderbolt related. My iMacs don't have Thunderbolt ports on them, but they do have something called a mini display port. I think that's right, a mini display port. And I have a cable here that I bought off of Amazon for less than 10 bucks. It's called a, a male mini display port plug to male mini display port plug. So the connectors are the same on, on both sides, right? One is already plugged into uh, to the computer uh, over on the right. I'm going to plug this one into the computer on my left. Excuse me a sec, I'll be right back. Um, so there, that took all five seconds. Now, um, what you do, you're, you're halfway there. Now what you do is you go to Command and F2. Don't hit Command 2, Command F2, the function key, all right? Command F2, it goes black for a second, or blue, or whatever. Uh, it blanks out, and then then you're back. And now, what you can do, watch this. Whoa, I just moved my window from over, the, over there to over there. And uh, so now you can customize your workspace to a, to a large degree. If you have um, uh, some recent photo that you uh, wanted to uh, have, not on your right hand screen, but on your left hand one, or vice versa, it now could not be easier. Look at that. So, customize your workspace uh, to your heart's content. It works great. Now, if you want out of it, if you want to reclaim your, your Mac and have it be a standalone machine again, you do the same thing. And now, so it's like a toggle function. It, it works in the reverse direction. So, same, same deal. You hit Command, F2, screen goes dark for just a sec and then it comes back up and now we're back to where we started from just a couple of uh, a couple of minutes ago so you can go back and forth like that you don't have to restart the machine or unplug the cable or anything like that uh, i think that's pretty cool and uh, if that is helpful to anybody out there more power to you thanks for watching